So it's a new year, ton of new things happening around the borderland. I'm going to meet up with Kimber McCarden Foster with Destination El Paso. She's going to give me the rundown on everything. Come on. All right, Kimber, so we're standing in front of Tricky Falls. The bar upstairs is a cool bar. It's called Bowie Feathers in honor of David Bowie. And we're going to be honoring the rock legend this weekend, right? Absolutely. Celebrating his life and legacy here at Bowie Feathers Friday night at 9 p.m. Uh, DJs Renee Romo and lawyer lady Dr. Woman will be here uh, playing all of David Bowie's greatest hits. So come prepared to dance and just have a really good time and celebrate Mr. David Bowie. You told me they're taking requests. What's your request? My request would probably be Rebel Rebel. How about you? What do you uh, get out here? Life on Mars would be mine. Okay, so keeping with the music, you say we also have like a Led Zeppelin tribute band coming yeah, in. Yeah, they are the biggest, most successful Led Zeppelin tribute band in the world. Um, and they're performing at Speaking Rock this Saturday at 8.30 p.m. Another fun free event. I don't know about you, but my pocketbook is like pretty tight right now. Yeah, <laughs> we're post-Christmas, like nobody has any money. I know, so I'm all about the free events. We got a cool movie also that you were telling me about. It's, we're going to show it in the canyon, you were saying? Yeah, it's going to be shown at McKelgan Canyon Pavilion, $10. That's on Saturday. Everything kicks off at 4 o'clock. There's kind of a social hour before the movie. The movie is um, shown in conjunction with the El Paso Puzzler mountain bike race. I don't know if you're familiar with it. It is the toughest mountain bike race in the state of Texas. So pretty cool that they're tying in a film this year to kind of keep everybody entertained. It's called The Rider and the Wolf, and it's about... Mike Russ, who's a Hall of Fame mountain bike uh, racer, and uh, he disappeared without a trace. So it's a kind of a cool mystery film, but it also celebrates mountain biking, which we have plenty of here in El Paso. A psychic fair. Absolutely. If you're curious to know what this year has in store for you, you might want to go to the psychic fair. I don't know if I want to know. I don't know either. I'm a little bit skeptical, but I'm also intrigued by it. So I might go check it out, but that's taking place Saturday and Sunday at the Hawthorne uh, near the airport. And this last one is it's a big one. It happens every year, the Bridal Quinceanera Expo. Right. At the convention Center. At the Convention Center. It's hard to believe it's been going on for 26 years now. There will be more than 125 vendors for people to choose from. This is kind of like your one-stop shop if you're getting married, planning a sweet 16, having your quinceanera. Come find a venue, caterers, flowers, pretty much everything you need to host a special event will be here. Admission's only $5, and that runs from 11 to 6 at the Convention Center. All right, Kimber, thank you so much, as always. So you guys, lots to do this weekend. Go check it out.